For this exercise, we want to go to canva.com. You can either do this on your laptop or PC or on your mobile. What we're gonna do is just create a mobile wallpaper and it's gonna help us to remind us which paradigms we need to work on and what's our focus for that month. So if we go to create design, we're given um, a lot of different options here. This is something that you're going to be using if you have a business as well. It helps to create um, professional um, digital marketing. So we're just going to type in wallpaper. And we're going to go to phone wallpaper. So Canva has many different options and different layouts. It's one of the best tools out there for marketing and advertising and just creating digital designs. But we're just going to use it to create a mobile wallpaper. So um, down at the left hand side, we have a series of different templates. You can choose whatever one that you want. Um, I'm just going to choose this one, for example. Um, I'm going to just play about with it, change the text to paradigms. Um, you're going to create a design for yourself. You're going to give it your own branding. If you have a business, great. If you don't, don't worry about it. And down the bottom, you can put in your uh, website. And here we're going to focus on the paradigm we're going to change. So if you go to your worksheet exercise, down at the bottom, there's a couple of examples which I'm going to use, but you should have created your own whenever you've completed this worksheet. So I'm just going to take the first paradigm here from the paradigm examples. And I'm just going to copy it straight in. Again, you'll see the layout. You might have to play about with it. Change the colors that you want. Um, you can change the size as well. You can change the colors and the fonts. And if you want, you can change the, the background as well. So I'm just gonna double click on it here and go to my uploads and see what we can use. So I'm just going to use um, just going to use this one for example. I'm going to copy it straight over, and Canva is going to do the rest of the work for me. So we see we have a backdrop here. I can change the transparency of this as well. So add the logo. Just have a little play about with it until that you're happy. And what you're going to do is you're just going to publish this and download it and if you're on the desktop or um, a pc or laptop then you might need to transfer it across to your mobile phone somehow so you can use drops your one drive or if you if little tip for you um, i just use my facebook messenger and i just search for my own name and that's just a neat, really easy way for me to transfer files without having to worry about uploading it to, um, to Dropbox and then having to download it and then install it. For me, just transferring it via Facebook is really easy. So you're gonna put that on your phone. Obviously, you might wanna make it a bit more fancy than this. This is just a quick example. But what this is gonna do is you're gonna be able to put it on your phone, create that environment for success. It's gonna constantly remind you and trigger these thoughts of, of what it is that you're working on. And it's just going to be another aid to helping you to changing your, your paradigms and your belief system to one that's going to be more beneficial for you. So for me, for this example, I think this was one that I had a long time ago. I was just trying to be a bit more healthier and improve my, um, my, my confidence and my energy and just really focus on my body, just making it a well-oiled machine, as you can see here. You know, just things for me to make it really, you know, funny. If you're, if you're, if it's conjuring up emotions, then it's a good thing. So that's it for, for this exercise. Um, Canva is gonna come in in future lessons as well, especially if you're maybe on your way, if you have a small business or, Maybe you want to start your own business. Canva is going to be the tool, one of the tools that you can use.